Praise be to the name of the Lord. I want to welcome all my viewers all over the world into this new year, new season, new period of our time in the land of living. I want us to go to Psalm 31 verse 15 that says, My time and in your hand, deliver me from the hands of my enemies and from those who persecute me. Um, I want to just bring, borrow the phrase, my time are in your hands. What does this mean? God's own times and season. And the writer does not, when he was talking about time, he's not talking in time of our clock or rich watch. But he's talking on the time of season and period in the land of living. Coming to year 2023, God brought me and you into a new season and a new period in the history of mankind. This is your time. This is your season. And the time God gave to you and season belong to God. God is the God who have unlimited time. He is from beginning to the beginning of begin. He is the beginning of beginning. And he has no limited of time. But out of abundance of time of God, God placed me and you for a certain period and a certain season. Brethren, I want to congratulate me and you for us to see this season and time. But one thing we need to understand that God wants us to fill the gap in year 2023. He wants you to fill it well. He wants to fill it with His praises. He wants you to fill it with thanksgiving. He wants to, he wants to fill it by express His beauty and the glory in year 2023. Let every thing that is not of God in the past, go away with the past. Begin afresh with God in, in these new years, and God will deliver you from every power of enemy, from every power of those who persecuted the angels. Brethren all over the world, I want to pray for you today that this new year will be a new beginning in your life, a time of transformation, a time of divine visitation. Your mouth shall fill with laughter and your mouth shall fill with praises. I decree to the Lord, before the Lord, to all those who are listening to the sound of my voice today, that wherever you are, as you join me to enter into 2023, I decree that God will begin anew with you. He will begin his work in your life and your testimony shall be fresh. The glory of the Lord will shine in your life. This year, 2023, your testimony shall overflow. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Welcome to the new year, 2023. Happy New Year. Goodbye. Now listen to this verse very well. Your mercy elevates me. Promotion comes down from the east to the west. Your mercy promotes me. Everything I am and never I will be hey, was completed 
on the cross just for me. Your mercy elevates me. Rakosi ala matoli ala bojo. Your mercy promotes me.